Okay, I'll just show you how to delete a mobile from the Bluetooth audio system in this 2019 Vauxhall Astra. So from any screen, it's on navigation at the moment. Home is here. I'll just put it back to navigation and the phone is there. Click on phone. You'll see there, it's just brought up. There's nothing connected at the moment. Nobody else in the car with a phone connected. So it's just brought up this menu. You'll see there, music, symbol, the phone, handset and the delete or, or the bin. We click the bin. You have requested Barry's iPhone to be deleted. Once deleted, it cannot be used in the vehicle unless paired again. Delete. That's it. It's gone. Okay, I'll just show you how to pair a mobile to the Bluetooth audio system in this 2019 Vauxhall Astra. So first, first of all, we'll, we'll, we'll put that on any screen. Uh, we'll put it on nav to start off with. We go to settings, make sure Bluetooth is on. Then we're watching out at the bottom here, over to the system, and you can either click on home there and go to settings, or if you click on telephone there, it shows you there's no paired devices, search for a device, search for a device, watching out at the bottom here. It's already picked up my phone on the actual audio system, and then Vauxhall IntelliLink here. So click on that. It's now thinking about something, starting to pair Barry's iPhone with um, the system. 035737, does this pin code match? Yes, it does. So click pair and OK over there. Allow contacts and favorites to sync, allow. It's already showing their Vauxhall's connected and it's connected on the screen here. So very easy, simple process, nice and quick. OK, I'll just show you how to stream music from your mobile through the Bluetooth audio system in this 2019 Vauxhall Astra. So from any screen, that's on phone at the moment, over to your telephone, click on music, Macy Gray there. I'm going to turn that down, but click play. Over to the system. Now you see there is just telephone and there's the home button. So we go to the home button. You've got audio at the top, click on it. It's showing I try already. Now, if I turn that up and turn this up, there you go, that, that's playing. Okay, I'll just show you how to set the sat nav in this 2019 Vauxhall Astra. Any screen, over to the home button, click home. Then we want navigation, it's a touch screen. That's just showing you where we are at the moment in the map. What we need, like the two lines down here, if we click that, you can either go, if you've set home or work, you can go there quickly. So if you're miles away, you don't have to put your postcode in. If you've already set it, you can just click home or, as I say, work, and you will go straight there. Uh, the settings button there, head up, traffic on map, voice guidance. You'll see there's a red line under voice guidance, so voice guidance is on. That's quite important as well. We'll go back. We go to the search, the magnifying glass, recent favourites and address. Click address. City, country or street. We're on city and country. Um, so we're Grosvenor Garage, Blackburn Road, Higher Walton, Preston, P. Are. Now we want numbers. Numbers, you change the numbers in the bottom left hand corner here. The question mark are one, two, three, so we click that. PR5, four, back to the alphabet, E, A, PR5, four, E, A, search. That's it found. Hi, Walton, Preston, Lancashire, United Kingdom. We click go. In 300 yards, turn right to shop lane and then turn left. That's it. That's how you set the sat nav. Okay, the best thing about the audio system in this uh, Vauxhall Astra, it's a 2019 model. If you see there, you've got USB uh, or, or your charging lead. There's a USB socket in here. Plug the USB socket in. And then you get your phone, plug the other end into your phone. You'll see what happens with a bit of luck. CarPlay, right. This has come up on the screen. Device projection privacy consent. Apple CarPlay and its third party apps and services may use your vehicle information, including vehicle location. Only use Apple CarPlay when it is safe to do so and will not, it'll say, interfere with your driving or, or whatever. So continue. So continue like so. CarPlay finish. Let's just open it up there. Allow CarPlay with my Vauxhall while phone is locked. We want to allow there. That was finishing it. 
like so. So that's that done. Now you don't need to touch your phone at all. You can do anything. If I click there, see there the big square and then the three bars at the, at the side. If I click there, that will show you how far you, you're away from home, how long it'll take you to get home, what's playing on the audio uh, system and, and the map where you are. You'll see on there, that's the, the quick bar, that's the, the last used um, the, the last used bits of the app. Now then, you want to make a phone call, that's the voice activation there button, the voice activation button there, so the top left one. So if I put my thumb on there, leave it on for two seconds, you'll see the Surrey baseball comes up there. Call Barry. I didn't catch that. Could you try again? Call Barry. Calling Barry, iPhone. So you'll see there. Hi, this is Barry. That's Darren me there. So that, that was down me. Don't need to take your hands off the steering wheel. So you want to send a text, same thing. Two seconds on the voice activation button. Text Barry. What do you want to say to Barry? Just testing the Apple CarPlay system in this 2019 Vauxhall Astra. It's very, very good. It says, just testing the Apple CarPlay system in this 2019 Vauxhall Astra. It's very, very good. Send it. Yes, please. Done. So that's the text gone. Obviously, I've text myself. You'll see there, there's a one now in the messages box or at the top, and you've got a message come up. You're driving along the road. You can't lift your phone up. It's against the law. But what you can do, you don't need to lift your phone up because you just press this button again for another couple of seconds. Read texts. Barry sent a new message. Just testing the Apple CarPlay system in this 2019 Vauxhall Astra. It's very, very good. Would you like to reply? No, thank you. That's everything. So you're driving along the road and you want to navigate somewhere or you, you, you want to set your sat nav. You're on the motorway, you can't pull off, you can't pull over to the hard shoulder to do it, and you, you can't do this. All you need to do again is voice activation. Take me to the Trafford Centre, Manchester. Getting directions to the Trafford Centre. You'll see go comes up here, but you don't have to do anything. If your hands are firmly on the steering wheel, you don't have to do anything because it will do it automatically. There you go, it's just proceeded. Um, it, it's actually quite good because you'll see there it also gives you <laughs> directions on your on your well on your iPhone and on your Apple Watch. Um, so as I say that that's a fantastic system. If we go on to these boxes, these eight boxes here, like so, you'll see there you've got let's see. Just wait for that to go off. You've got audio books, you can listen to podcasts, your music. Again, I'm going to put the, show you the music, but this is only so you can see what happens. You don't need to touch that. What you hear, shuffle music. There you go. Or that'll play anything, or if you want a specific track, Play Marie's The Name. Here's Marie's The Name, his latest flame by Elvis Presley on Apple Music. A very old friend. Fantastic system. As I say, you don't have to take your hands off the steering wheel. And we'll just go back and I'll just show you a couple of other things. So you've got maps, we've done messages, we've done the phone. Just wind along there. You've got Spotify, um, Google Maps, Audible. If you go to Audible, that's got all the all the audio books that, that I've got on my phone, and I can I can just listen to anything. It's uh, it's a really really good system. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.